lines. Three, two, one, go. Here we go in match one of the finals. Swart Dogs 525 looking to place a hatch panel on the front of the cargo ship. They've done so. Their teammate, the McGuanago Bears. They got one hatch panel on the far rocket for the Red Alliance, trying to make it two. They will do so now. Blue Alliance got hatch panels placed on their far rocket as well. Now the Trobots, 5013, looking to get a cargo pod under the cargo ship. They will do so for the Blue Alliance. Iron Lions do the same in the far blue rocket. They're being defended by the Knights, 2957. Red Alliance continuing to score. McWanico Bears and the Sport Dogs forming an effective partnership. Cargo pods going into that red cargo ship quickly, almost as fast. And on the blue side into their cargo ship. Coda Collective now in position to play some defense. They're targeting the Swart Dogs. They knock a cargo pod loose. Swart Dogs quickly go and gather another. Blue Alliance continuing to get cargo placed into that cargo ship. They've also got another pod into their far rocket. Red Alliance still with the narrow lead as we come up on a minute to go. Red Alliance, they've got the Swart Dogs trying to place a cargo pod that goes off the mark. Coded Collective may have given them a little nudge there on the defensive end. Red Alliance down a robot at the moment. The Knights not mobile. The Iron Lions add a pod in for the Blue Alliance. They've taken the lead by only two points as we enter the late stages of the match. Coded Collective continuing to defend. Swart Dogs shake it off, get a pod placed into the cargo ship. Time running down, another pod placed into the mid part of the far rocket by the McQuanago Bears. They'll try and add one more in the late going. The Trobots first to the habitat for the Blue Alliance. They will climb up there, up on the upper level. Smart Dogs not far behind for the Red Alliance. Their teammates right there with them. Going up to the second level of the Iron Lions, 967. Time runs out in the first match of the finals. Spring another upset, 81 to 71. Great cargo score on both ends, but it's the Blue Alliance, the three seed that are one win away from the Iowa Regional Championship.